presence of vulnerable children in Tyson's value chain is shameful and should be swiftly and effectively addressed. For years, long-term investors have tried to engage Tyson in good faith on issues of human rights due diligence, racial equity, and worker health and safety. However, investors remain concerned that the ongoing scandals of these intersecting issues point to systemic problems within the company's value chain, starting with Tyson's mismanagement of the COVID-19 pandemic, which resulted in thousands of infections, hundreds of worker deaths disparately impacting workers and communities of color. In response, Tyson committed to conducting a racial equity audit in 2021, but has not followed through. And now, recent governmental investigations have documented illegal child labor in Tyson's operations. Children have been engaged in hazardous work, including using caustic chemicals and cleaning sharp and dangerous meat processing equipment. More recently, there have been allegations of illegal child labor in Tyson's contracted chicken farms. Investors are concerned that the presence of illegal child labor in Tyson's value chain may be a tragic symptom of the company's disregard for the well-being of its workers. The requested audit is a necessary first step to root out illegal child labor from the company's value chain and to identify larger patterns of worker exploitation and mitigate systemic risk to investors. I urge all shareholders to support this proposal and I call on the company to end its exploitation of black and brown workers and of children. Worker rights are human rights.